G'day, Artie McDowell from OntoAustralia.com. This video will show you how to find the best optometry courses and degrees so you can study optometry in Australia. And it will show you some tips and tricks on the best websites and apps to use. Do you know $85,000 is the average salary for an optometrist in Australia? This is according to Payscale.com. So what about you? As an optometrist, you will love to help people. You will examine people's eyes, perform vision tests, diagnosing and treating sight problems. Popular skills for an optometrist include diagnosis, treatment and planning, patient education, customer service, oral and verbal communication. If this sounds like you, then keep watching and learn what websites and apps you can use to find the best universities, tapes and schools in Australia. There is a lot to cover in this short video, so we will be quick. You can press pause at any time or repeat a section if you need to. You will see how to use three websites, Krikos, OntoAustralia.com and Quilt. The first is Krikos. It is created by the Australian Government. It lists all the courses offered to international students in Australia. First thing you need to do is click Course Search. It will bring up the search screen. Here you can use some useful filters. You can filter by state, course name, course type and field of education. After you have set your filters, hit Start Search. A list, of, a list of courses will load. You will see columns for course name, provider, level and duration. Krikos only displays 20 courses at a time. You will need to click the next button to load the next 20 courses. This can be time consuming. It is the main reason we created the Onto Australia search app. And we will show you how to use it next. Now you need to click the course that you want to display. It will load the course details screen. You will see four tabs. Course details, course locations, institute details and contact details. The first tab is the course details. The most important details here are the tuition fees and the duration. You will also see a location map. The next tab is the course locations. The third tab is the institution details. And the most important details are the website and the total number of students. The last tab is the contact details. The next website is OntoAustralia.com. We created this search app because the Krikos app was hard to use. The data in this, in this app is based on the Krikos data. At the moment, this app only lists university courses, and it only lists the top 26 universities. First, let's look at the filters. You have course name, state, ranking, average cost, level, and duration. We created a unique ranking system. You can find out more about it in the description below. After you have set some of your filters, you will see the results set decrease in size. There is no submit button. It just happens automatically. You will see a list of universities. You can click the green view courses button to see a list of the university courses. You can follow the links to the university website for more details on the course. The last site is called Quilt. Here you can compare different institutes or universities. It is based on thousands of surveys of real students. You can compare up to six institutions. First you need to click on study areas. Now click your study area. We will select nursing. Next, choose your level. 
Now you will see a list of institutions. You can filter the list. You can filter by institution type, course level, or state. Now you need to select the institutions to compare. You can select up to six. After you have added to your list, hit the compare button. You will find some charts and tables. Here you can see some of the chart types. There is also a handy video created by Quilt. You can find the link to the video in the description below. Did you like this video? If you did, please hit like. Check out the links in the description below. Also, for more information, check out our website. There is a free course with tips on how to study in Australia. Until we meet again, bye.